Now, here's 12 Sports. Well, the countdown is on for opening day at Polar Park, a day that marks a brand new chapter for minor league baseball in the Red Sox organization and in our area here in southern New England. Our own Rosie Langello got an up close look at the stadium today and now joins us from Worcester. Well, opening day is just 21 days away here at Polar Park and fans will get to experience a brand new ballpark and all of its amenities. But park officials tell me that they're not going to forget the 50 years spent in Rhode Island at McCoy Stadium. Take me out to the ball game at the brand new Polar Park, now home of the Worcester Red Sox. I mean, we had 50 wonderful years in Pawtucket and all of us know that Pawtucket was just part of the baseball vocabulary. But now it's the city of Seven Hills turn. Worcester adopting the franchise and putting their own spin on it. The park holds 9,508 people and any seat in the house gets a pretty backdrop. But this is what general admission gets you. But looking out into the field, you'll be able to sprawl out on the berm, just like you were able to do at McCoy. And if you grew up fishing for autographs at McCoy, they will have that too. It's a different flavor of ice cream. I mean, it's 78 years old and this is brand new and this has so many features. While a lot of the park is still under construction, park officials showed us how this park was designed with wheelchair accessibility in mind. You pivot the seat, you slide the wheelchair in, and the able-bodied companion sits with the wheelchair companion. And when you visit Polar Park, make sure to stop by and see Mr. Worcester. Again, opening day here is on May 11th. You can see Smiley is here. You can visit him when you come. General admission tickets start at $9, and you have a great view pretty much anywhere standing room here at Polar Park. That'll do it for us here in Worcester. For Smiley, I'm Rosie. Back to you, Maury.